Hello, I'm Sig Solo. Welcome to my channel and to this Thursday Extra video. I got this uh, razor in um, a couple of days ago, all the way from Hong Kong, from Alpha Shaving Works. It's this one. The Alpha Shaving Works Outlaw Evolution Titanium. Look at this beauty. Man, 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 man. This is the Viper 9.5. Uh, so it, uh, it's 95 millimeters long, it's 30 millimeters wide and it has this special flat knurling. And if I show you this next to the stainless steel one, you might see that this doesn't have the barber pole lines going all the way down. This one doesn't. Uh, and it has a more raised um, knurling in it. But still, still, this is the titanium one. The head has been changed also. If you see here uh, on the base plate, uh, the thingies here that hold the blade, that clamps the blade, has been uh, made bigger 300%. The base, the top cap is 6% wider. And also he made the head 6% lighter even though he made the clamming area the thing is here 300 percent bigger so to give it a better balance this is 70 grams the stainless steel one is 123 i also have the copper one but this is with the bravo handle the nine oh sorry the 85 millimeter long only handle and this is 129 grams. Um, the exposure is zero, it's neutral, and the blade gap is 0.70. On this one that has the mild, it's 0.56 um, millimeter. And on this one that has the standard plate, it's 0.72 millimeter of a gap. So it's in between the two. And I tell you, this is such a beauty to watch. The brush, sorry, the soap for today is the Barrel Proof by Singari Man. Um, a beautiful bourbon, sandalwood and oakwood scent soap. And from the puck, it's a six out of 10. Lathered up. It's a little less, I would say it's about a four and a half, maybe five, but a beautiful, beautiful um, woody, sandal woody, oak woody scent with uh, the bourbon lying underneath somehow. The brush is this, the Alpha Shaving Outlaw Aluminium with the super synthetic, super silver tip synthetic fan not that is not available anymore and this is the copper the ball is the copper obsidian from captain's choice there you have them let's get this party started the blade is the vismet on its third use again like the last time i used this soap it's very, very, it's almost a cream. It's croppy to the point of a cream. You know, like when you have the dough made up for some bread and it's all fresh. Uh, so very um, soft So When you first apply the brush to the ball, it foams up like kind of a shampoo, lots of bubbles. And if you are like me, you might think, oh no, what is this? But you just keep at it for two or three times the normal length with the brush. And then a thick, nice leather will evolve. So don't worry, just keep at it. it takes a lot longer. Then 
most other soaps I have tried. Uh, but you know what? For me, soap is me time. Making soap and shaving is me time, so I don't mind. Okay, let's give this the first go. The base plate was changed a little too. So the scalloping on the blade is different to make it smoother. And, and also some of the rounded uh, places on the top cap has been made more square to give it an even more modern look. So it's 260 with the long handle and 250 with the shorter Bravo handle. It is all titanium and I tell you this is a smooth shaver. I'm not going to lie, I was worried that this might be a bit too aggressive with this 7 zero, it's not at all. I do feel the blade a little, but just enough to let me know where I am at. So, like the stainless steel outlaw razor, there is some blade feel, but only, in my opinion, a little to let you know where you're at. Man, nice. And another thing, I pre-ordered this back in July, uh, waited like everyone else for it to be done. Good things take time, you know that. And then when it was ready to be shipped, it only took seven days to come here from Hong Kong. And that is some kind of record because Usually from Hong Kong or Asia, it's four to eight weeks, usually. So seven days, that's crazy fast. Wonderful fast, so. I don't see that record being broken ever. It's really nice to get this razor because when you're online in forums, this razor pops up all the time for the moment, and rightfully so. It's a wonderful shaver, I tell you. Apart from those three, I have the Claymore Evolution. AC and that is also a wonderful razor that I like very much. It was released a couple of years ago. So thing takes time. I believe this razor was three years in the making. Almost three years that is. Uh, from what Stephen told me, Stephen Tinder, the guy behind this. Uh, I will, of course, leave a link to his side for you to go and buy it. And also, of course, to where I purchased the soap. Heather. Singari man, 
don't ship to Greenland. Mostly U the US, I think. So I had to wait for the racer company to get it. I wrote her and she said within a couple of weeks the racer company will have it. And that is what I did. So I will of course leave a link to the racer company for you to go and see if this is still available there. So that's how it is. Not all of us are situated in the Connors area. So a perfect shave, I might say. Wait, let's see. Wait a minute. I just sit that and then I fill. Oh yeah. Gone down. The head is so little and nimble that I can get all the way up my nostril. It seems that that's where my most coarse growth is. Let's give this down here a, an extra attention. Some extra attention. What I tell you. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful reason. I tell you. I'm really, really satisfied with it. So. And also, you might sit there and think, hey, sick, why do you use the alpha shaving brushes so often? Well, it's easy. This one here with that super duper silver tip synthetic and the perfect balanced aluminium handle, the outlaw that is. That's my favorite brush. Really. And the Bulldog, the black anodized one, is my number two. Everything is measured according to that. So that's my golden standard. The recovery splash. It looks like of semi milky, you know, not full fat milk, but semi fat. And this should be enough. I get the oak wood, maybe a little sandalwood, but absolutely no bourbon whatsoever. Not yet, that is. Maybe it comes later when it has dried up. I don't know. But right now, all I get is the oak wood and the sandalwood. The rest on the elbows. Are you ready for the? Sound test. Perfect, Amundu. Thank you, Steve Tinder, for releasing this racer and for making it. Um, it's a great, great uh, racer and it will last me forever. So, you know, changing things up is not always for the better, but this one, I must say, better shave, a better change. So, go check it out if you want to in the link below. Six Solo. Ah, wait a second. Like, subscribe, hit the bell and share. And you know why we do this? We do this because we are not obsessed. We're dedicated. Six Solo, out.